Uh, okay. We landed on it, but we killed it. Hey everybody, welcome back to Just Cause 3. I'm Charlie Tank, and today we're just going to do a um, editing tutorial. Record a little bit of video, and um, we're going to go edit that video in Windows Movie Maker. I'm going to show you a little bit of basics, what you can do. I'm not an expert at it, so I don't know everything, but I'll show you what I do. And we're going to actually try out RTX Meat Lugs Challenge. We are going to try and land on that train right there, and then we're going to go edit it. And I'm going to show you a little bit about Windows Movie Maker, just like I promised in the Friday Viewer Challenge. So, we got to get a little bit of a run. Now, we could use... Oh, yeah, this one's a slow one. So, as soon as we touch that train, it's going to fire at us. So, we need to land on the train. Oh, we missed it. All right. So, here we are on Windows Movie Maker. Um, when you record videos, you need to find out where they are, where they're kept. Now, I've made mine into folders. Um, Just Cause 3, you know, they all have, so, mine are kept here, we're going to upload this one, we're going to cut it here, because that's where I start talking, so I'll remove that, then we're going to go right here somewhere, I'll show you what I do, and we're going to actually try out RTX Meat Lugs Challenge. Okay, we're going to split it here, put his challenge in. I'm going to go to the desktop for that. Put that in. Now, there's no secret about this. I mean, everybody does it a different way. I mean, I don't add a lot of special quality editing features because this is what I use as Windows Movie Maker. Now, sometimes... Well, there's something that I'm working on that's really special right now. I'm using Sony Vegas Pro 13. So, um, for the editing fact, uh, let's see. So now, I want to add the second video, which is on the one terabyte. This goes three, and this is the second video here. So, I'm going to scale this down, and then I'll be right back. Uh, it takes a couple of minutes, and I have a custom setting also that I'm going to show you. Uh, you can create your own custom setting. I have a 60 fa frames per second. I also use uh, the Android Large a lot. Um, I don't use it unless I'm uh, doing something short. Like I used it for the uh, shark video that I just did. Um, last night so I want to uh, I'm gonna show you the settings and uh, we'll get back to that in just a moment all right to find music for your YouTube it easy way is click here go to creator studio from there go to create which you'll see at the bottom I don't want to click this because it'll show my email address and you know blah 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 so yeah all right now here in create you've got your audio library where there's hundreds probably thousands of tracks that you can use um, now here is music policies now this is what you cannot use see and I like you can't even monetize your video not even with one second of this music playing um, and this is very helpful to come here and see because it'll show you what you can and cannot do with the music. Okay, ACDC, eligible for, ah, you can't monetize your video. So this is really helpful. Alright, so we downloaded a track uh, from the mute 
uh, the audio library, add music to the current point, at the current point. So we're going to put this music in here, right here. We're going to go to music options. We're going to start a little fade in and a fade out. So we're going to set the music volume here. I don't want to go too loud because I don't want the music to go over what I'm saying. All right, here we go. We're gonna... Oh, I forgot to mute my mic because it's echoing. I'm going to try and land on this train. Whoa. Oh, I've got a heat level. I didn't even touch the train. All right, so there's the music in. All right, here we go. We're going to try and land on this train. Whoa. Oh, I've got a heat level. I didn't even touch the train. What the heck? Oh. Now, this is the um, faster mech. And we're going to try this one out because this is Protato's mod. It's faster. It jumps. Well, okay. I thought it jumped higher. Oh, yeah. Okay. We can jump a lot higher than a regular mech on this one. So, is that... Oh, I see. I thought that was my chair making that noise. I was like, wait, what? But it's the mech making the noise. Okay. So, we're just going to try this out. Now, RTX Meat Lug, he's got some awesome videos. You got to go check him out. He's a smart little guy, and um, he does a lot of uh, tutorial videos that... Uh, everybody needs like android phones and stuff like that so you gotta go check him out this is his channel come and check him out okay let's see well we're not gonna be able to well we might be able to catch it yeah we'll catch it uh okay we landed on it but we killed it <laughs> oh, gosh. oh geez ah uh let's get it out of the way though Uh oh get out of the way so the other train doesn't hit it no okay let's go get this other piece okay it's off all right so uh yeah this is the right train to land on so this is we want to land on that middle one no okay it's gonna oh this has got a lot more armor than the regular ones so we could probably maybe do this. All right, so. All right, so I've got my movie all set up, and I'm going to put this clip right here. Now, uh, one important thing that I always do is I always put an exciting clip at the beginning, then my channel intro. Now, Jerry Hayes made me this intro. Thank you very much for that. And, um,. We're going to go into the settings, the render settings now. Uh, let's see. Let's see. File. Okay, now, save movie. You want to come down here. Create custom settings. Now, I've got one here. Create custom settings. You want to put this at 1920. By 1080. Now you want to put this at 60,000. That's 60,000. Okay. And you want to put the next one at 60. So that's going to... You can leave this the way it is because that's a pretty good setting for that. And then you just click save and um, it will save it. No. I've already saved it. Uh, I've got it. 60 frames per second test and 60 frames per second render so that is how you do the custom settings in Windows Movie Maker now like I said I'm not a pro I don't know everything about it but this is the way I do my videos for my Friday viewer challenges because it's fast and simple this jumps really high maybe too high oh look at that we got on the train but it's already dead so it's now you said this is possible not impossible but I'll do this on the uh, Friday viewer challenges and we'll see I uh, can't seem to land on it without hurting it so 
Let's see. Where are we gonna land it? Oh, as soon as I jumped it, it started firing at me. Whoa, I got hit by another train. All right, so 